Hey, it's Mike Anderson, and I'm here to give my first try on the Aria uh, biometrically correct running shoes. So let's take a look at, at these shoes. And as you can see, the toes are pointed. They do have a definite angle to them. And I'm kind of rocking back and forth, and that's because the heel, the entire bottom of the heel, is rounded. Uh, the rest of the shoe is vented. Uh, a lot of foam going on. It's a fairly lightweight shoe. Um, not minimalist in, in design, but it is lightweight uh, sole. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take them for about a mile run and see how that goes. Hi, okay, I'm back from first run and did about a half mile on them uh, and it felt interesting. That's I said in initially that they were about the funkiest thing I ever put on my feet and you can definitely feel a difference when you go running in them. Um, if we go down, what I noticed, I noticed as I was running I could feel a difference in the front of my shin and then actually in my lower, like up in my, uh, my lower thighs and my quads uh, a little bit as well as Kind of in the, uh, like in the kind of the plantar fasciitis type region, so under my underfoot. Um, it felt different, it's kind of the, the whole thing. And obviously, a half mile is not enough to get any real assessment. The other thing that I did want to mention is even within a half mile, these things are prone to a very common thing, which is the inability of shoelaces to stay tied on running shoes. So that's a uh, you know, that's just kind of a funny thing that I think all of us experience anyway. So, thanks for watching, and I'll have more detailed review as I uh, get some more miles on these things.